Chad's transitional military leader, Mohamed Idris Derby, said that his country needs massive support from partners to stabilize an economic and financial situation severely impacted by the security situation and the coronavirus pandemic. Dabi, who took over after his father and former president Idris Dabi died last week, said in his first address to the nation that the military took over after the president of the National Assembly declined to assume constitutional powers. At least two people were killed and 27 injured in Chad on Tuesday as demonstrators took to the streets demanding a return to civilian rule. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.